Hi guys, welcome back to another bit of news. Um, so my hair's all messy today. But uh, yeah, so we're talking about the Phantom X concept. That was actually um, a video went out on DJI back in, uh, I believe, I've got all the details on the screen here. Um, yeah, back in November 2015, way before the Phantom 4, before the Maverick, before the Spark, before even Inspire 2. They got together with, um, hi guys, I got together with a, a lady from uh, Agent S.H.I.E.L.D. She was one of the um, agents in S.H.I.E.L.D. I can't remember what her um, actor's name is, but she was um, appeared on the video about the Phantom X concept. And it was basically a bit like the Phantom shape, uh, no legs, and the camera sort of in, in the dome underneath its belly. And it's been sort of a concept since then. And obviously now people are talking about, oh, Phantom 5, it's going to be the Phantom 5X coming out. Be interesting to know because this is something that they've thought about going back many years. We know DJI, they're way ahead of technology. They're way ahead. Like, for instance, uh, when when they was, when they were bringing out the Phantom 3, they, were, they, were already have, they already designed and built and started testing the Phantom 4. That's when we were all getting the, the 3, then we got the 4. And as when we got the 4, they already built the Maverick, and then that came out a while later afterwards. And I bet you when I was designing, just finishing designing the Maverick, they was probably building the Spark. So they are very much always way ahead. But this has been around back then, 2015, when drones were like, you know, we were like, it was all coming out. There was drone shows, uh, everyone's talking about drones and new concepts, things like that. And this was back then. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the video, link the video below after the video, so you can have a look at it anyway. So wonder if this is they're going to what they're going to release. Wonder if this is what they're going to have. Be interesting because this seems to have all the features of like the Phantom Four we we all love to know at the moment. It's got extra features like throw up in the air and it hovers, taking that from the li the Lily type of drone. <laughs> but yeah, throw up in the air and it hovers. But what's what's really good about this design is you can paint. Uh, in the sky with your hand and the drone will follow you so I don't know if that's one, some sort of glove you you wear with specialised um, fingers on there with motion sensors that talk to, I don't know but when you look at the video um, the agent shield lady she's got some gloves on when she's actually drawing in the sky sort of thing and these drones are doing these like patterns and stuff but it'd be interesting to know if this is something they've actually built and is coming out very soon and the other thing I also noticed on here, because it's got no gimbal anymore, it's actually built in with the drone, so it's quite protected, but it doesn't show any land landing legs on it, so I'm not sure how that um, how it lands, or they've got tiny little feet on the ends where the motors are. It's still a quad-based system. And there's another good, cool feature as well, it was showing in the video, where you can have like several, seven of these, or you know, quite a few of these, all up in the air. They all talk to each other, so you can create those multiple camera angle shots, so you've got a car driving, each one can be at different angles, um, shooting the, the scene of the car. So you're not just having one drone following the car, you're having like three, four, five of these that go in. So that's another thing it showed in the video. So I wonder if this is going to be an interesting one. I wonder if this is going to be something they're bringing out as the Phantom 5. Bringing the X to the 5, that would be interesting to know. Yep, I know that, I just said that in the video. Um, dates back to 2015, I know, but there's a lot of rumours of people saying is it Phantom X, I just noticed on social media, that's why I thought I'd do a quick video on it, um, whether it is something. I know they, they, they thought back in, back in 2015, wonder if they're going to bring a version of this one out, but who knows. Again, there's a lot of rumours going around and it's getting hot now, because as we build up towards Christmas, what happens towards Christmas? People start putting rumours saying it's going to be a new drone coming out from DJI. We don't even know yet. Normally when there's rumours go out, somebody comes up with the pattern ideas. Because first of all, when DJI creates a drone, they pattern it. And they normally that's normally an open to Joe public. And that's how we used to know about the different versions of the Phantoms, the, the Inspires, when they were coming out. Because we we found the pa pattern painting and when they painted in it, basically. And we can see all the details, what what's roughly is coming out and stuff. But nothing like that. It just seems to be rumours at the moment. Keep it on the official website. We're spot on with DJ rumours. And we will let you know. And I'll sort of give you up some tips. So, um, yeah. So we're all speculating at the moment. So it's interesting to see what DJ does bring to the table. But I think DJ should start looking at maybe um, bringing out a new Osmo. Because I know they got the new cameras for the Phantom 4 Pro on Advance. Uh, it'd be nice to see that handheld. They've got the Inspire 2 camera, which is like shoots at 5K and 4K at 60 frames. It'd be nice to bring if that can be com uh, converted over to the Osmo handle as well. 
they've done a lot of up, they've done a lot of sort of releases. Maverick Spark. Um, they didn't really go for a full four. They they decided to change the paintwork for it and and stuff, you know, and release that as another Phantom add-on sort of thing, you know. Um, but um, yeah, so interesting to know there's gonna be a Phantom Five or Phantom Five X coming out, and also I like to know. I know they're doing a lot of modifications on their Ronin rigs and stuff, but it, but nothing on the Osmo side. So I own the Osmo and the Osmo Plus. It'd be nice to see a new Osmo out, you know, maybe better frame rates, um, you know, um, something a bit more better. We'll see. But it'll be interesting anyway. But I thought I'd quickly cover this anyway. So I'll put the link of that video, which was back in, because it's quite hard to find on DJI because they've got hundreds of videos on there. Um, so that was on the 3rd of November 2015, the concept of Phantom X, which is quite interesting. Watch the video, you make your minds up at that and tell me what you think anyway. Put all comments below. Um, and if you like this video again, guys, thumbs up, thumbs down if you don't like the video. And if you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. And see you on the next video. And I'll keep you posted with any up more rumours and updates that come to mind. And um, get the feelings out there. But do you think the drone industries? Well, as as a drone person yourself watching me, do you think um, the drone industry is sort of shot down? Are you still buying or looking for the next drone? Comment below and let me know. So it'll be interesting to find out. So thanks a lot, guys. Oh, uh, yeah. Before I go, if you guys are selling drones or if you're a drone trader uh, selling drones, have your drone sales dropped? You know, um, what you're doing and also what you're doing about if your sales are dropped, what, what, what other things are you going into? Let me know below. It'll be interesting to find out and see you on the next video guys cheers and thanks so much for joining on we'll keep i'll keep watching your site and um yeah we'll do some updates on this so cheers guys